Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new here. Today we've got a wonderful closet clean out. One of your guys favorite videos and one of mine as well. We're going to be organizing, cleaning, decluttering, all the things and we're doing it in two closets in this video. So go ahead and grab a snack and let's get to cleaning and get you guys motivated to spring clean your own closets. Let's go. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new here. It may appear that I am standing in front of an unassuming white door, right? Nice and like clean, tidy looking. Behind these doors of this tiny little closet would shock you. My sister is a secret hoarder. Just kidding, she's gonna kill me for saying that. But I'm at my sister's house, which is why it's so bright and beautiful. But today we're gonna be cleaning out a couple of her closets. She is pregnant, she has a toddler, she doesn't have time for this, and so I'm here to step in. If you guys like DIY, organizing, thrifting, reno, that kind of stuff, I've got it. So I would love for you guys to subscribe to this channel to see more after this video. We have lots of fun plans coming up. We have plans to buy a house, plans to decorate it. So if that interests you, Make sure you're subscribed. Go ahead and give this video a like and let me know in the comments down below what your favorite thing to organize is and what brought you here. So without further ado, you guys, take a second, let's pull ourselves together and let's look at this closet. Okay, so it may not appear that bad, but it's definitely not working for my sister and we wanna make it work for her. Because again, young mom, two young kids, we've gotta make things easy and organized for her to be able to get out the door. So today we're gonna to be tackling this closet as well as hopefully a couple other ones to kind of help clear up her space. So the way that I always like to start everything is by taking absolutely everything out, going through what we do, don't need, putting things in other places, and then making this functional again. So let's go ahead and get started. How's it going? How's it going about you?
I'm gonna tell you roll. And a baby on the way. <laughs>
biggest thing to remember when cleaning out any area, especially a closet, is making sure whatever you took out and don't want back in has a home to go to. Otherwise, it's just gonna end up right back where it started. So make sure to take the time for your mess pile, your junk pile, that you put it back where you want it, find new homes for it that really work for you so you're not cleaning out a new closet with the same stuff that you took out of the first closet. That's my biggest tip and make sure you do it that same day because otherwise you know it's just gonna end up right back in that closet where you don't want it. closet is done now it's time for the linen closet which might be worse all right we're gonna start by taking everything out and then figuring out what we want to keep and organizing it nicely and hopefully it stays that way for at least a week <laughs> let's do this
pictures the before of that closet for us all to remember its disastrous state. I'm not judging. For those of you who watched my closet clean out, you'll know mine was in a much worse state after shoving every possible thing I could think of in it for six months. But let's look at this after nice and clean and organized and ready to use. Everything is where it should be and much more accessible and easy to take out and put back. So I hope you guys enjoyed these closet cleanouts. Let me know what other types of videos you would like to see. And if you aren't already, please make sure to subscribe because I've got lots more videos like this coming as well as some awesome DIYs, thrifting, and hopefully some home buying adventures. So go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Are you helping clean up on it? Thank you. Clean up, clean up, everybody, everywhere. Yay! Yay.